The story of the film begins with the child Natasha, who is 10 years old. She was with her father in a nightclub and was happy and enjoying, and we get to know her parents are separated. Natasha's father was so drunk that night that he forgot to send his daughter home early because she had school in the morning, and after late at night he takes her back to her mother's house only to sleep two hours and then her mother came to wake her up so she could go to school. Natasha tells her mother that she is still sleepy. Her mom tells her that nightclubs are not for kids. She tells her that if she goes to nightclubs again she will not let her go out with her father. Natasha told her mother that her father loves her and wants to make her happy unlike what her mother does. The mother gets angry with Natasha and hits her, but she feels wrong and tries to apologize to her daughter but Natasha takes her bag and goes to the school. As she walks down the road a man gets out of a car and kidnaps Natasha but there was a little girl who was present and witnessed the kidnapping. The kidnapper then takes Natasha to his home. When he entered the house he put Natasha in an underground room and locked the door on her. Shortly after Natasha regains consciousness, she found herself in a small isolated room and it was locked. Then she knew that she had been kidnapped. The person who kidnapped her comes and gets her bed and gets out. Natasha was screaming and trying to make noise for help but it was useless because Natasha noticed that there was soundproofing in the room. The room had no way out except for a small ventilation hole. Three days after her kidnapping, the person who kidnapped her whose name was Wolfgang comes and brings with him some food and some storybooks. When he entered the room Natasha was afraid of him and did not say anything. He read the stories to her and after he finished he wanted to go out but Natasha asked him to kiss her on the forehead because she had been used to it by her mother. He was hesitant about it but kissed her on the forehead and walked out. The next day Wolfgang watches the news of Natasha's kidnapping. His mother was also at home. She comes to him most of the time to cook for him and clean the house. Wolfgang's mother saw the news of the girl's kidnapping and was surprised. She asks her son about who kidnapped this girl. He tells his mother that whoever kidnapped such a child is not sane and will certainly be arrested. After his mother left the house Wolfgang goes to Natasha to wash her hair but Natasha asked him to deliver a message to her mother. The content of the letter is that Natasha is in good health because her mother will be worried about her. But he refused and tell her that he demanded a ransom from her family and if they really love her they should pay the ransom. He told her that he had notified them but they did not respond to him. By that he means that her family does not love her. But she started yelling at him and told him that he was a liar. He could not stand it so he drowned her with soapy water. Before leaving the room he asked her to clean the room and he tells her that if she does not clean the room he will kill her. One day Wolfgang his mother and his grandmother were in the garden. The police come to the house and ask to search the house because there is a girl who witnessed Wolfgang kidnapping a little girl. After searching they did not find anything. The police asked him about his whereabouts when the accident occurred. So he told them that he was asleep so the police left him. In this scene Natasha was sad because she missed her parents. During this time Wolfgang enters upon her and he has food with him. Natasha asks him to get her a watch so that she can count the days and find out how long she is still kidnapped. Indeed he agrees to that but he had a condition. The condition was to obey his words and she agreed. Then he made a communication device between them. Suddenly Natasha asks him and tells him do you feel lonely like me but he did not answer her and left. All night long Wolfgang thought of Natasha's question and the reason for asking such a question but he did not get any answer. In the morning of a new day. And 183 days has been passed since Natasha's been kidnapped. We see Natasha adjust to the situation and she was playing inside the room. It was her role as the professor in the room. After that she draw a cat on the wall. Wolfgang began communicating with her through the device he placed on the wall and he asked her to brush her teeth and asked her to do what he asks of her. In fact she does what he asked of her. And in this scene Natasha was sticking some food to her hand in order to delude Wolfgang that she was sick with a skin disease. When Wolfgang came to her. She told him that she had a skin disease and that he needed to go to the doctor. But he held her hands and knew it was a trick. When he found out that she was trying to deceive him he decided to punish her and he decided not to give her food for four days. During these days Natasha drank only water. She was very exhausted and had no energy. Wolfgang talks to her through the device and asks her to abide by orders and not disobey them. Natasha fearing punishment agrees. And after four years have passed since the kidnapping of Natasha. Natasha was in an unstable condition and started to look pale in the face and also lost weight. Natasha has reached puberty. She asked Wolfgang to go to the bathroom in the house to take a shower and also to see sunlight for the first time since her kidnapping. 
Indeed he agrees to that but he tells her that he has placed explosives on the doors and windows in case she tries to escape. Indeed Natasha was able to take a shower and also see the sunlight. In this scene we see Wolfgang's mother glimpse a hair on Wolfgang's clothes. She was happy about that because she thought Wolfgang had a girlfriend. We know through this that Wolfgang had a psychological condition and his mother knew about it. But Wolfgang was angry so he decided to shave all of Natasha's hair. And 1837 days after the kidnapping which coincided with Christmas Day. Natasha was happy and was wearing a crown on her head and she started celebrating alone. Suddenly Wolfgang enters bringing a camera and gifts and he asked her to open the gifts that he brought her. When she opened the gifts Wolfgang would photograph them. There were three books. Natasha was overjoyed by the gifts and they were celebrating together. Natasha asked him to let her call her parents but he refused and was angry and told her to forget her parents as if they had died and told her that her new name was Vivi. In this scene Natasha is helping Wolfgang to renovate her room. So Natasha asked Wolfgang to go out and see the garden of the house. Indeed he agreed to that but tied her hands to his own. And when she went out to see the garden with him suddenly Wolfgang dragged her into the house and began to treat her very harshly. And he threw food on the ground for her to eat like animals. 2029 20, days after Natasha was kidnapped Natasha goes out for the first time with Wolfgang to the supermarket. But he threatened her and told her that if she asked anyone for help he would kill her. And he told her that he carried a gun with him. And when they entered one of the stores Natasha was looking at the people with a sad look and she didn't know how to ask for help or escape. Then Wolfgang came and brought paint with him so that they could paint her room and then they went home. When they arrived. They were working on renovating the room. And after 2175 days have passed since the kidnapping Natasha saw her room and was very happy with it. In this scene Natasha was listening to her story on the radio. She learned that her parents thought she had died. Natasha asks Wolfgang why he kidnapped her and why he didn't kidnap anyone else. He told her that he had seen her in a store she was smiling and eating cookies and he tells her that he liked her and because of that he had been digging for 8 months to build a room. Then he kidnaps her and brings her to the room. One day Natasha decides to commit suicide so she burns a number of handkerchiefs inside the room but because of the smoke she couldn't bear it so she decided to put out the fire. When Wolfgang learned of the attempt he beat her. Then Natasha counted how many times Wolfgang would hit her. And she used to write it on tissue paper and put it in a box. And after the past of 28 and 47 days from the kidnapping. On this day Natasha was with Wolfgang to go skating. At first Natasha fell easily because of her lightweight but after some time she could skate. Natasha was waiting for any opportunity to escape. Natasha tells Wolfgang to go to the bathroom and when she went into the bathroom Wolfgang was waiting for her outside. Natasha finds one of the girls in the bathroom and asks her for help but unfortunately that girl is a foreigner and does not know the language. So Natasha came out of the shower sad and then she went home with Wolfgang. When they arrived Wolfgang beat her because he had discovered that she had tried to escape and asked the girl in the bathroom for help. 3096 days after Natasha was kidnapped. This period is about 8 years and 4 months. Wolfgang asked Natasha to help him clean his car. The reason for that was because he wanted to sell his car because he had lost his job and had no money with him. And while Natasha was cleaning the car she saw the door of the house open. So she took advantage of the opportunity and escaped. And she went to one of the nearby houses and she asked them to tell the police. Fortunately the police were nearby and Natasha was happy when she saw them. She told the police everything and told them that she was Natasha who was kidnapped 8 years ago. When Wolfgang learned of Natasha's escape he went to the train tracks and stood in front of the train and committed suicide. The police informed Natasha's family that they have found their daughter. The parents were in disbelief. And when Natasha's parents arrived at the police station they saw their daughter eight years after her kidnapping. Natasha was in a very difficult situation and she saw her mother and father. Natasha wasted eight years of her life because of the madman Wolfgang.